right now let's go to the gas station and get some gas we about to go meet up with my pops we'll get some uh some texas roadhouse i think it's what it's called or original roadhouse one of the two we're about to go get some uh some lunch real quick and i'll probably go clean out the mustang man my shit is really dirty like hella dirty but good thing i got that extra battery y'all need that go for the gopro man i got the hero 7 black Make sure y'all y'all got that motherfucking extra battery because that shit be draining. Boy, that shit look like my fucking fuel tank. You know what I'm saying? That shit go down real quick. But all right, man, we'll catch up at the gas station. All right, y'all. So we just got to the gas station. We're going to get no car wash today. Even though your boy need a car wash. Look at that shit. That shit is hella dirty. we we'll put that 91 in because, you know, we're not E85 yet. Soon, 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 soon. Soon we will be. Make sure we got some gas. Like I said, your boy was hella low. But anyway, y'all. Yeah, so I don't got a, um, I don't got E85 to it. It's, it's lowered. Lowered on some Ibox Sportline Racing. Lowering springs. I don't know if y'all can see it. Don't mind the dirty ass fucking car, but. I don't know, can y'all see that in there? Maybe you can see it. I'll check the footage out later. But 1.5 in the rear. So that clean ass drop in the rear. Look at that. Jeez. Um, and at 1.3 in the front. So that's so much. That's what we got done to it right now. So we're gonna put gas. And then we might go wash it, man. Look at this shit. It's hella dirty. Stupid dirty. Got some interior mods as well. My fucking leather seats. You know what I'm saying? Custom mod. All right, damn. Hold on. That shit went too damn fast. We done right there. So yeah, man. I'm gonna give y'all a more thorough walk around. When I have the time. Might do it later today, just a little something something, but I'll get into it a lot more later. Uh, right now. Right now we about to go get some uh food with my pops right now, like I said earlier. So let's go ahead and do that. Woo, y'all hear that startup though, you know what I'm saying? Not the digital cluster, because you know what I'm saying, it's got the old style. It is what it is, but I'm gonna go ahead and put y'all back on here real quick. There it is. They got a little mount for y'all right there. A little GoPro mount. Look at my phone. But yeah, so we out, man. We about to go get some food right now. Just Roadhouse with my pops. He just got off work. So I'm going to meet up with him before he takes off back to work. So we'll go ahead and go do that real quick. And then probably going to go wash the Mustang. Like I said, it's hella dirty. And uh, it shouldn't be like that, man. Car enthusiasts, I got to keep my shit clean. But without further ado, man, let's get right to it. So I'm gonna meet back up with y'all when I'm with my pops, and then uh, yeah, so let's get it. All right, y'all. So we pulling up to the place right now. I just seen a GT350. I was trying to get a run in with it, man. Jeez, I know you probably would have took me out, but it's all for fun, man. It's all for fun and a safe environment, of course. You know what I'm saying? But it was clean. It was a. Uh, I think it's the Kona Blue. I think for that year it was called the Kona Blue. That's the original color that I wanted was the Kona Blue, man. By far, that was my favorite, favorite color for these new Coyotes. Um, I was gonna get one. So when I went to go look at these Mustangs, um, I had, there was this one, and there was a uh, black one, and then the Kona Blue one. So that one had like the digital cluster gauge, and it had a uh, magnetized suspension. I wanted the digital cluster was cool um but i wasn't willing to pay for the extra 2k for it and the magnetized suspension i think was another 2000 so i wasn't willing to pay like at least 4000 probably close to five man what the hell is this car doing bro man you can't trust people out here boy anyways yeah so i wasn't willing to pay like another four grand on top of whatever else i was paying for for just the color that's pretty much what i would have been buying it for the color i mean the, don't get me wrong the digital cluster gauge is cool and the magnetized suspension is cool but i mean i heard that there's problems with i mean not problems but you have to go through more steps to lowering the magnet ride i'm pretty sure uh correct me if i'm wrong if i'm wrong but um uh yeah so there's more issues i guess you want to say with lowering on the magnetized suspension i was like eh, i don't really need that uh, so I got the gunmetal, I think it's called gunmetal gray, mag magnetic gray, something like that. Uh, my buddy had it um, back in 2018 when he bought it. Same exact one as mine, except he has uh, air-cooled and heated seats. I don't have that. It didn't come with it. And we'll, we'll get into all that later, man. Right now, um, 
we about to meet up my pops is right here he fucking uh talking on the phone private business or something like that so without further ado man let's go meet up my pops damn we gonna eat today or yeah say what's up to my vlog hold on i'm recording dad <laughs> yeah there he is the man right there the nismo bride shout out to my pops he gave me this uh gopro battery pack charger so i'm gonna be using that oh, let me get my phone real quick <laughs> gotta bring my extra batteries man oh, let me get my phone oh, i know i know you was on the phone right now yeah, I was talking to my business DM. meeting or what Trying to find it in the oh, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so let's go eat, man. Original Roadhouse Grill is where we're gonna go eat at. I seen a GT350 right now. When I was coming down, I was, I was trying was to catch white? up to it. No, it was a blue one that had white stripes, though. Yeah, I was trying to catch up to it because I wanted to get a little racy race or something. But it was an older head driving it. Huh? I want to go to the track. I want to go to the Formoso and uh, do a little test hits. Don't blow your engine up. Nah, that's what it's built for, Pops. <laughs> Not the Nismo Bride, though. A little 372 point liter in. I think you will. Take out the jump. Nah, I just. Oh, shit, my mask. I got one. <laughs> yeah, good thing I put it in there. I got that fake Gucci mask. <laughs> Alright, y'all. We're about to eat right now, so I'll record a little bit later, but. Peace. Uh, so we're gonna go check out Best Buy right now. Don't laugh at my uh, fake Gucci mask, man. I'm not rich yet. <laughs> There's my pops. Look at him. We go incognito look. <laughs> my son's about to buy me an air pad. Sure. So we're going to Best Buy. No, I'm not. I'm but anyways. Hard. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna go check out Best Buy. I might get a phone case because my shit's all fucked up and it's been two years old. Damn phones. <laughs> That's coming later. But anyway, so. We're gonna check out Best Buy, see what they got. Probably get it the game too, honey. Check out the game, probably. Check out the game. Yeah. Until then, I'll see y'all later. It's popping, y'all. So we just got done eating at the Roadhouse Grill. And we just got back from Best Buy. So my pops didn't get nothing, but I had got this uh, little shorty, little GoPro extender thing. I thought it was... Look, man. I thought this shit was longer than this, but fuck it. We'll, we'll make use of it. We'll see what we could do with it. I could put it on a spoiler or whatever. But um, I also, my dad had this clip, which is a really good clip. I could use it for like POVs and other things if I don't want to put it on top of my dash. So right now we're going to go take off. I was going to wash the car, but as you can see, sun's getting low. I'm running out of daylight. And I want to talk a little bit about the car, kind of what the future channel holds. And uh, just go from there, man. So let's get right to it. Let's get this remote start real quick. Hold on, hold on. All right, y'all ready? Let's get it. parking lot right now we got somebody over here learning how to drive hey that, i remember when i was learning how to drive i always wanted to drive man that shit was fucking fun to me but yeah man so just got done eating with my pops right now so look man it's a 2020 mustang gt performance pack one performance pack one remember that um anyway so a little overview of the car it's lowered on iBox sport line uh lowering spring so it's what i say 1.5 in the rear and 1.3 in the front i believe you still got that little bit of gap but it's not too bad and the one thing that i decided to go with too as well is 25 millimeter spacers um up front you can kind of see them right there a uh, little back part yeah up front and in the rear as well so i noticed a lot of people that lower them on these set of springs are lower mustangs in general uh the cars are i mean the uh, the wheels are inside they're tucked in more so obviously i didn't want that fellow stang driver right there obviously i didn't want that i wanted a more flush more fitment more aggressive look 
and that's exactly what i got man so um couldn't be more more happier with the the setup that i have i'll probably change it more in the future depending on the mods i go what route i want to take with the mustang um no sponsors but you know what i'm saying that's what's on the car <laughs> chemical guys you know what i'm saying dirty ass car right now but it's all good um yeah so i got that for my suspension setup and then as far as my exhaust i have a corsa extreme cat back exhaust system um i love it man i honestly wouldn't want any other exhaust on there <laughs> besides getting headers i mean i couldn't complain about the exhaust i looked into a couple other ones but um my buddy actually had a 2018 same one and he had the um the corsa extreme and i just love the sound of it it's really loud it's uh aggressive and it just flows with the car man i just when i first bought it i was like god damn this car sounds weak man but it's all good hey that's why i had to do my duty and open it up open this bad girl up so yeah that's everything i got done to the car right now um and that's about it man so it's 2020 right there buddy but yeah so we're gonna be bringing y'all some more car content in the future um i guess i could go over a little bit more like what what exactly i did kind of like steps to it um how i got it done everything like that i could make a video about that and then uh future future upgrades as well so what i got in the works for it right now i want to do a little bit of a aesthetic look so i want to get a front splitter think about going street arrow um adding to the rear um so these cars the performance pack one came with the um a rear diffuser already so look i'm gonna show y'all real quick so you guys can check it out um yeah so it came with the rear diffuser already um i'm just gonna basically add those little slits to it like in the corners so i wanted to get that and i want to get the servini's um front grill and lower grill on there as well i feel like it makes it look way more aggressive and it just it just flows with it man so that's what i'm gonna get next done to it so yeah y'all stay tuned for that but other than that man it's kind of like a overview of my channel in a sense a lot of car content i want to bring to the table um what i'm gonna do with it and as well as um other stuff you know lifestyle man it's the life of bryson uh, channel so it could vary for what content i put out there uh, car content maybe um just adventures other car meets things like that I have other things coming up so um just kind of like a quick video man so until the next vlog I'll catch y'all next time more content more everything coming up soon so y'all stay tuned hit that sub hit that bell man do what y'all want man i'm gonna just be doing this for fun and then just going with the flow all right man i'll catch y'all in the next one peace